Hi, and welcome to this episode of Linux in School. Today, we are going to be playing games on the Steam. Hi, I am Nico Luhmann. I am the Educationist, and this is my channel where I show you how easy it is to get Linux running on your personal laptop, desktop, in school, and what can you do with it. Now, most of the time I hear that, hey, Mr. Nico, uh, you can't play games. You can't play games on Linux, that's not going to be cool. And I beg to differ. So this episode and couple of others, I am going to show you what kind of things you can do to make sure that you have games. And oh boy, do we have games. We have Steam. Let's check it out how we can do this. Now, um, my favorite thing is to use the terminal. So uh, let's get going. Um, oh, by the way, just to um, show you. So this is um, my favorite uh, type of um, Really, I, I I do like this this terminal. It is uh, called Terminator, and uh, because why not? And so I can um, do stuff like this, where I can be um, putting on some information, showing to you that I'm running a Xeon uh, processor, 12 cores. Um, I am running OBS as you can see and it's uh, consuming all most all of my processor right now interesting um, I am also um, I'm I am actually backing up my so in the background I am backing up my machine right now and so that's taking a lot of my bandwidth okay um, my memory I have 32 gigs of RAM and and so forth but hey um let's install steam that's what we're here so we need to be super users we need to use the package manager and we need to tell the package manager what we're going to install so that is all the commands that you need to know to be able to install steam oh well you need to know the name of your package manager and that's it you need to do your password and once that is done, it's going to say, hey, um, we need Steam devices as well. If you want to use a Steam controller, hey, that's what we got to do. You got to do. And here we go. Installed Steam. How fast was that? That, oh, that was not, that did not take long. Let's see. I'm going to start it off from the command line here just to see what is going to happen. Okay. We've got the installed version. Um, it's going to connect to my account. And oh boy, here we are in Steam in less than five minutes. Okay. Let me see what I have in my library. Okay, let's see how fast I can get Generation Streets up. Hey! Here we go. All right. So this is it. We've got a game playing, running, and yeah, cool. So if I take a new game, go over to maybe somewhere here. Okay, Arkhangelsk must be something like, uh, I'll go to the Vaskrezenskaya Ujitsa. Total random has to be easy because I don't know how to play this game. And the start. As you notice, I did not mix up with any of those um, settings. Oh, I noticed that I wasn't. Yeah. Okay. All 
Alright, what is it? Oh, Alright, so it's A double okay. And. Ah, okay. I can shoot. Do I need to collect these? Yeah, sometimes. so random all right you see uh, way better uh, gameplay from people who actually know how to play games this was just uh, for me to really give you um, a taste of how easy it is to get something like steam running now um, really steam works exactly the same way as it works on other platforms so there is no point for me to show you that what you can do um, you can um, really look at games you can get so you can add them to your queue um, and see what do you have Next in my account, so I have RimWorld coming, I have Oxygen not included, um, and started, yeah, so a lot of things on my queue. And so basically, ooh. Now, the, Valheim, uh, I just wanna say this, uh, just uh, this is an, um, for Linux, uh, developed on Linux and, and works on Linux, and they all just went over a million um, million um, subscribers, uh, 1.1 uh, I think right now, um, overwhelmingly positive, uh, great Viking game, so that's something I need to add to my, uh, onto my list, um, of course Counter-Strike uh, works, so anything that has the Steam logo, that means that it natively runs on Linux, now, does that mean that I cannot get Apex Legends? No, it does not. I can use Vulkan layer on top and it can then run also Windows games. So basically I can get all of these. Yeah. I could get all of these to run on my, on my machine. So, there you go. Ooh. Did I see steampunk somewhere? Is that, yeah, that cyberpunk. That's it. That would not run on my hardware. <laughs> um, so, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this is how you get Steam running, and this is how well you can start playing, um, how quickly you can start playing on your... Linux machine. Now, as I said, um, 
Cyberpunk would not run on my machine, um, but if you like, if you comment and make my channel really popular, then maybe I'll have a chance to upgrade my hardware and, and then I could be able to show you how to get Cyberpunk running on a Linux machine. Thank you for watching and join me on the next one.